Pierce going over the top, and he's got past Denver. Denver out to the races, and he is down. Touchdown, Winnipeg. Pirates, Denver. 82 yards. His first catch of the football game and his first CFL touchdown. Money shot. Buck Pierce put it on the numbers. Pierce flying. Deep in Edmond territory. Pump fake right end zone. Left. Touchdown, Winnipeg. Clarence Denmark does it. A 17-yard touchdown strike. Buck Pierce to Clarence Denmark. Second and ten. Here comes the rush. Goals looking to the end zone. It is caught for a touchdown. Clarence Denmark. What a catch. How about the belief? How about the belief by the quarterback tossing it out well before he was open? Watch Goltz. He gets rid of this with timing. Throws a pretty ball. Let's him go get to it. Denmark stumbling. He's on the ground. One hands it. One hands it as he's on the ground. Denmark making an unbelievable grab when Winnipeg needs it the most from the 13th quarterback. Interference called downfield against the Owls. So we'll redo it. Brink. End zone has Denmark has the touchdown. Good toss. The offense finally finds the end zone here tonight. Rush again. Brink to the end zone. And it is caught. It's a touchdown. Clarence Denmark hauls it in. He's hurt in the end zone. What a catch. And the rookies become famous for this stuff. The final play. <laughs> it's been a while. <laughs> Brick underneath Denmark. Can it get to the end zone? Yes. Touchdown, Bobbers. Saw so this guy when they dropped him. Out of the end zone. Touchdown, Clarence Denmark. Just like that. And answer that early defensive touchdown by the Lions. Play action fake to Bull. The inside. Well, they bounce back. Second touchdown catch of the year for Clarence Denmark. And Max Hall, after getting up, he had to shake off that hit. Recognizes blitz. He has the free man. Picks up Clarence Denmark on the slant route. And they do erase the defensive touchdown from BC to start this game. Here they come. Hall gets it away. Well, he gets something positive. Something they can build on at halftime. 35-yard touchdown strike. But a bit of a desperation throw in a situation where you want to be protecting the football with a chance of points before the half. 15 seconds to go. There he goes again. Streaking downfield. Making the catch. Touchdown. Clarence Denmark. How about this? Right at the end of the play, the acceleration of Clarence Denmark to go and get this football when it's in the air. Looked like it was going to be an overthrow. But Denmark just zeroed in on that ball. Much better than last week against Edmonton. Still has to find the end zone. Denmark getting some blocking help here. Clarence Denmark, a crease. He'll find the end zone. It's a touchdown. Just like that. The Blue Bombers are in the house. Fake to Cotton. Willie has a man open. Touchdown. Clarence Denmark. Willie gets the time he needs here to allow Clarence Denmark to run that corner route and, and he does a nice job of it too. He got court parts all turned around. Now on second down. Drew Willie throws to the goal line and is caught. For a touchdown, Clarence Denmark. And a number of them have played deciding roles in football games. Drew Willie. So it's second and ten after the penalty. Willie from the pocket. He's going to let it go. Deep. Clarence Denmark in behind coverage. And it's a Winnipeg touchdown. 75-yard strike. Willie to Denmark. That's his fourth 30-plus 
He did that last year as well. Clarence Denmark in behind everybody. Safety Josh Bell gets caught looking at Drew Willie. He steps up nicely in the pocket, puts air under it, and Denmark tracks it down. Longest play from scrimmage for the Bombers this season. The first touchdown for Clarence Denmark. All right, here you go. Third down gamble. to the back of the end zone. Touchdown, Clarence. Denmark, 9.6 on the clock. It's Chris Adams in motion. Goes the other way. Easy touchdown. Welcome home, Clarence Denmark. Touchdown last year. He has this pick here tonight. A huge one. Nichols back to add it. Open man. Touchdown, Clarence Denmark. 29 yards to pay dirt. Two games, two touchdowns for Denmark. Leading after three quarters this season. Matt Nichols pulls it back, pulls the string, has his man. Clarence Denmark again. He's gone. See ya. Touchdown. He's done it again. The way that Clarence Denmark has come back to this team. This might be one of the greatest comebacks ever. Closing in on 200 receiving yards in this ballgame. Seven catches, 195, and a pair of touchdowns. Nichols, corner routes, touchdown, Clarence Denmark. Blow some kisses. Denmark gets back in the lineup this week. Denmark gets back in the end zone this week. Towards that versatility, interchangeability, guys are being asked to drop in coverage more. Nichols fires to the goal line, touchdown. Clarence Denmark picks it up off the turf, and this one will count for Winnipeg as Clarence Denmark has his fifth touchdown reception of the season. Matt Nichols gets it low and outside where only his guy has a shot at it. What a catch. Yep, so we'll get to Nichols looking oh. deep. Six-yard touchdown strike. He just needed to take that break between the third and fourth quarters and get to the fourth quarter where they've been so dominant. And just like that, the offense does get the traction they need. Two hot offenses, though. Nichols goes to the end zone. Has a man. It's a touchdown. Clarence Denmark. For a chance for a touchdown, and there it is. Flag on the play, but Denmark in the end zone. Let's find out what the call is. Illegal contact on a receiver, BC number 39. That penalty's declined. Touchdown. That thrown it to me. I don't. He doesn't have a catch, but he has two runs for 21. Now rolling out a little bootleg throw into the end zone. Touchdown. Clarence Denmark who had touchdowns in each game against BC last year, has one here. All the way. Nichols looked one way, now the other. Has his man, has a touchdown, Clarence Denmark. Denmark's second score of the season. The Blue Bombers and Alouettes continue to go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. As to whether it's an incomplete pass or a fumble. Second and goal, Nichols to the end zone. Touchdown. Clarence Denmark. And the Winnipeg Blue Bombers, who are the best in the Canadian Football League, taking away the football and putting points on the board. Key down here again for the Bombers. Oh, what a catch! And it's a touchdown by Clarence Denmark. Second and ten from the 12. Lots of time for Nichols. Throws to the end zone. Touchdown! Clarence Denmark. There's Denmark just running a dig, slow development play, great protection up front by the big boys, and Nichols steps into that one and throws a heater on the eight and the nine. Clarence Denmark having a career year. It's his fifth touchdown in the season. Now Nichols pulls it out, throws to the end zone. Touchdown! Clarence Denmark has.
has two. A short kick results in a quick touchdown for Winnipeg. Trying to punch it to the end zone. Nichols throws, and it is a touchdown. Happy birthday, Clarence Denmark. Blew out the candles yesterday and finds the end zone today. Yeah, the veteran man in that receiving core. 